One of the hardest lessons that I ever learned as a minister of a church is the lesson of my way is not necessarily the best way. And as a young minister, I thought, boy, I'm going to have my way and I'm going to do it my way because I know what is best. Well, I quickly learned, I mean quickly, that that was not the best. It's one of the hardest lessons in life. The lesson that my way is not always the best way. So if you have a decision to make or if you're looking for a brand new idea, know to remain open-minded always. And God will show you a better way if you're open-minded. How can you know that you're doing what God wants you to do? Well, you turn to God in prayer and you ask for guidance and then you listen. Now, so many people, when they're asking God, they're actually telling God, God, this is my way. This is the way I want it to be and no other way and make it work my way. Well, in the quiet of prayer, God will speak to you with an idea or a feeling that will comfort and will strengthen you, but you must do your part working with God to remain open-minded. And you'll draw upon God's strength when you're dealing with situations in your life or dealing with others or when you're feeling alone. It doesn't matter how serious or trivial the current situation is. You can always rely on God. And you will see that when you're open to a higher way, that it will always be also in your best interest. Looking for God's way, you'll discover the better way. It says in the Bible, strive for the greater gifts, and I will show you a still more excellent way. 1 Corinthians 12:31. I pray that you're open to God's way today, and I pray that you discover the better way.